So you've got your instrument that is monophonic and sounds in mono. At some point we will be adding space to our instruments by using delay or reverb. And the trick here is that we make our space effects really wide, as opposed to our instrument being in the middle. I will be using echo here. I'm creating an effect track to have a little bit more control over my delay. So this is dry signal, this is wet signal. I will turn it all the way to 200%. And I need to select here pin pong. Now as we can hear our delay is really wide and our instrument is in the middle. At this point we created a really good sound space because we made a contrast between a thing that is in the middle and the thing that is really really wide and they are interacting in their own way. We can reverse this so let's have our instrument to, to be really stereo, really white. So I have unison here and two voices and let's make our delay in mono. So let's listen without the delay so that we know our sound is stereo. But be careful, if you have a lot of instruments, I would highly suggest you to play with them, pan them, or make a contrast between them by making some instruments mono and some instruments really wide. That's it for this video, I hope it helps. And one more thing to say, recently my channel has reached 200 subscribers, that's a really really big number to me. And I wanna say thank you to everyone who watches my channel, who is subscribed to my channel, and who is not subscribed to my channel, who is liking my videos and commenting them. I'm happy that the things that I say are helping people. And I have a little surprise for you. It's a free sample pack, which contains some atmospheres and some inspiration loops to help you to start a new song as soon as possible. Thank you, see you soon.